New at six, a landmark decision in the fight against Alzheimer's. The FDA has approved the first treatment to attack the actual disease process itself. But the move is not without controversy. The FDA approved the new drug despite opposition from an independent advisory board. The treatment, called aducanumab, is delivered through IV, and it aims to remove amyloid, the sticky gunk found in the brains of patients. By removing that, it is assumed that the individual will have clinical benefit um, and improvements in cognitive decline. This is huge news because this is the first drug that's approved for the treatment of Alzheimer's disease that's disease modifying. Alzheimer's expert, Dr. Michael Weiner, heads up the brain registry at UCSF. Many experts did not think that the FDA should approve this uh, treatment. FDA advisor, Dr. Caleb Alexander, recommended against its approval. I think that the evidence is still quite murky as to the safety and especially the effectiveness of this product. Even so, Contra Costa County scientist C.C. Selgren is thrilled. Right now, I have something that's going to slow down my cognitive de decline. C.C. was diagnosed two years ago. She wants to remember her son's college graduation. It gives us hope, you know, and um, and I think that's 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 just huge for us to have that sense of hope. Well, the FDA approval is conditional. The, the company will need to conduct post-approval trials to verify the benefits, if there are any. And if they can't verify, the FDA can pull the approval.